Hi guys, this is Abby from the Entrepreneur Center and today I'm going to be giving a brief overview of Hopin, which is the new uh, virtual event platform that we just got access to, which is awesome. Uh, Hopin is really customizable and more dynamic than Zoom is, which allows you to have larger or more participants, larger scale events. Um, you can have different kinds of meeting rooms, which I will show you in a second. So let me start sharing my screen. So here we are on the back end of Hopin. So as you can see, you can see how many registrations you have had. Uh, you can even have ticket sales in here so people can buy tickets from Hopin directly or you can like outsource it to Eventbrite. Um, so yeah, here's all your data for your event. And we are looking at Pitch for Good right now, which is an upcoming event. And then you can look at key details. This is where you'd put in name of your event, you can customize your URL, uh, starting date, end date, and then this is my favorite part of Hopin. So you have um, your event stage, which would be like your keynote speakers. That's people, they like tune into that and you can even outsource that to like YouTube live. Um, and then you have your sessions, which are like small uh, group meetings, and then you can have networking which allows people to have kind of like speed dating you can make the sessions like as short or as long as possible you can set up specific people or you can have it just kind of like open um, for people to meet one another so like naturally as it would be at an in-person event and then you have your expo which is good for like product demo um, advisor meetings people can pop in at any time and watch those and then you can have different type of events, public, private, hidden. And then here you can manage ticket sales. You can have different kind of tickets, so speakers and attendees. And then here you input your event details. You can upload your own logo, event background, and add your sponsors. And then there's like a reception or like waiting areas. So that's where um, all the events would be. So that's where people would be directed to when they enter Hopin uh, as a near attendees. And then they can choose where to go from there. And then here you can manage your stages and you can put the different titles, who's speaking, what time, say with networking. Here we have our maximum duration minimum then you can choose which kind you want and then you can add your speakers so people can see the lineup you can input the schedule so this is where you can organize all of your events and this will be available to your attendees so they can see the lineup and they can even add it to their own google calendar and so they're able to pick and choose what they want to go to. And another great feature of Hopin is all of the data feedback that, I get, that they give. So here we have live analytics to see how many active users are on the event right now, uh, where they are, what they're doing. And then at the end of your event, you can get event summary reports that will give you all the data you might wanna know. So all of those, which is awesome. And then you can preview what your event will look like. So this is the reception or the waiting room that all of your attendees will be taken to or the general public, depending on what type of event you're planning to host. Um, so here, like I was showing, this is completely customizable. So you have your logo or whatever event background you wanna put your event description, the sponsors, and then here down at the bottom is your schedule. So like I was saying, you can click on this, add calendar, gives you all the details, and then people can even share it on various social media platforms, and you can purchase your ticket here as well.
So it is a great platform for larger scale events. As I was saying, I definitely prefer it over Zoom. Um, it gives the feel of an in-person event in that um, it's very user friendly and people get to network. They, there are different types of um, events, stage, expo booths, round tables. Um, so very customizable and very easy to navigate.